adversity to making auto maintenance decisions. Sometimes those decisions can be, uh, be frustrating. You're trying to figure out, am I going to save money doing this myself, or is it best to take my vehicle in and let them keep it a few days, depending on the situation. Sometimes they have to keep it a few days to get this job done. And you're wondering about cost. My vehicle, so I like to, when I buy a vehicle, um, I keep it a long time. I don't care about uh, the fashion and the latest model. But the vehicle that I, I like, most of, most of them are SUVs or some type of van. I like hauling stuff and hauling, hauling all my tools. But this day, I had to make a decision. <clears throat> Do I want to replace these head gaskets myself? Or can I replace these head gaskets myself? How long will it take? Then I need a place to do it. I can't be bothered, can't have people around me because I can't be distracted because this is serious work here. At the time I didn't have a garage so I had to find out um, who's going to loan me their garage. I got the garage, then I have to time it where um, I have, can have people going back and forth. So I started this project about uh, between 8, 39 o'clock p.m. and worked all the way over to about <clears throat> 10 a.m. the next day. Worked overnight to get this job done. I wasn't sure what I was going to run into, but I had an idea what I was looking for. I was looking for cracks in my head gaskets both of them. Something was wrong. I was leaking antifreeze and I wasn't getting enough power, enough, enough, enough boost in my engine compartment or from my engine compartment. So I had to make a decision. I knew the cost was going to be high, but would it be worth it? Was I going to let someone disassemble my motor or at least the top portion of it you have to tell me you have blown head gaskets. I wanted to find out myself. And the cost with this project, I, I called and found out, would be um, over $1,300. But that's still, there's no guarantee that once they got everything back together, the vehicle was going to run good. You, you would have been out of $1,300. And time waiting to win the vehicle. If, you, if that was your only vehicle, then you had to make a, a decision. I have to be back to work, or I have to be doing, I have to be, I have to use my vehicle. <clears throat> but this day I made a decision to go and investigate the blown head, head gaskets myself. <clears throat> it took from about 8.30 to 9 o'clock at night, over the next day about 10 a.m. After putting everything back together, <clears throat> But I forgot that um, I should have had, well, I wasn't sure. I had to find out um, what's going on. I discovered two cracks in both my head gaskets. Not my head gaskets. In both my heads. I discovered two cra cracks in both my heads on my engine block. Now, once I found out what was wrong with it, I had to make another decision. Um, do I want to go to the junkyard and recover two heads? Not knowing whether or not if they were going to be damaged. Or do I order two heads brand new? Either way, it would have been time consuming. But I had to find out what was going on inside. And I set out to do that. It took a long time. I found out what it was. So I still had to make a decision on um, what to do next. But I wasn't out. I wasn't out of $1,300. This, this has to be done. Um, quickly, right away, once I found out uh, what was going on with it.
and um, I didn't have the time to um, order two heads or go and purchase two new heads. I didn't have the time to um, go to the junkyard and recover two heads where they show if they're going to be damaged also. So um, at least I found out what was going on with this van. In both my heads. I discovered two crack cracks in both my heads on my engine block. Now once I found out what was wrong with it, <clears throat> I had to make another decision. Um, do I want to go to the junkyard and recover two heads? Not knowing whether or not if they were going to be damaged or do I order two heads brand new? Either way, it would have been time consuming. But I had to find out what was going on inside. And I set out to do that. It took a long time. I found out what it was. So I still had to make a decision on what to do next. But I wasn't out. I wasn't out of $1,300.